Hi friends. I hope you guys are doing great. Um, I know things look different and Ms. Cher is not teaching you in our classroom. I'm actually teaching you from my house. So for the next couple weeks, hopefully we get back to school soon. Um, Ms. Cher is going to be teaching you lessons from my house. So today we're going to talk about the zoo. And if you guys have a piece of paper or a special notebook or maybe a whiteboard, I want you guys to help me write the word zoo. If not, no big deal. You guys can just help me um, by saying the letters with me or the sounds or just following along. All right, friends? So we're going to start by getting our whiteboard or maybe a piece of paper and we're going to write the word zoo together. All right, here we go. Z O O Z O O It spells zoo. Friends, that's what we're going to be talking about this week. Ms. Cher is going to send you videos. Some are going to be um, songs, some are going to be books, and maybe we'll even get time to play some games together. All right, so today we're going to talk about the zoo, and I brought some friends with me that I would like you guys to meet. Sounds good? All right, here we go. Now, you guys know I love to play games with you, so today I brought my magic box. You guys all know what this magic box is. Ms. Cheryl likes to get silly with it. Inside my magic box is some of our zoo friends that we're going to meet today. All right? I'm going to need your help, though. I have one, two, let's see, three, hmm, maybe six friends. I'm not sure. We'll have to count them together. So what we're going to do is I'm going to, do you remember this song? We're gonna shake it in, shake it in, shake it in. Stop! What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? <gasps> Whoa! You know I like to flip it. Let's see what our first animal is. I'm gonna give you some clues and see if you can guess it, okay? Hmm. It has four legs and a pouch in the front with a long tail. This animal carries its baby in the pouch. Do you know what animal it is? You're right! It's a kangaroo. A kangaroo hops on the, the two bottom feet like this. Boing, boing, boing. All right, what is the name of the baby kangaroo that the mommy carries in her pouch? Hmm, you're right, it's a joey. Kiss your brain, you're so smart. Okay, I'm gonna put our kangaroo in our zoo. Boing, boing, boing. Okay, you ready for the next one? Here we go, sing with me. Shake it in, shake it in, shake it in. Stop! What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Wow, that's so crazy! This one's really tiny because I didn't have a big one. So we're gonna have to look really close, okay? Here we go. It loves the water. And it likes to clap with its fins like this. And it eats lots of fish. Do you know what it is? You're right, it's a seal. A seal lives at the zoo. Here it goes. We made sure we put him in the water. Okay, here comes our next one. Sing with me. Shake it in, shake it in, shake it in. Whoa, flip it! That's so silly! <gasps> What's it 
gonna be? What's it gonna be? Ooh, this animal says tweet tweet. It has two legs and it flies. What is it? You're right, it's a bird. A bird can live at the zoo. Friends, there's lots of birds that are at the zoo. You can find birds all over the zoo if you've ever been there. All right, we're gonna put Mr. Bird in our zoo. Okay, here we go. Sing with me. Shake it in, shake it in, shake it in. Stop. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Okay. This animal, ooh, is big. It says raw. Do you know what it is? A bear lives at the zoo. There's a different kind of bears at the zoo. If you can think of them, you let me know, okay? You send me a video. I'm gonna let your brain think on this one, all right? Let's put our bear at the zoo. Okay, friends, here we go. Shake it in, shake it in, shake it in. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? <gasps> hmm. This animal has really big ears and a long nose. Hmm. What is it? That's right, it's an elephant. An elephant has big ears and a long nose. An elephant is found at the zoo. All right, we put Mr. Elephant in our zoo. Okay, friends, we have just a few more, okay? Let's sing our song. Here we go. Shake it in, shake it in, shake it in. Wow, that's so crazy. Let's flip it. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? <gasps> this animal's big too. He likes to say, rah! He has a mane around his face, which is a lot of hair. He has a long tail. What is it? You're right, it's a lion. A lion lives at the zoo. Awesome job, friends. Okay, I have just one more, but this one, well, he's just a puppet because Ms. Cher couldn't find her, well, her little friend that, mm, he might be hiding under the bed. I'm not sure. Anyways, here we go. It's our last one. All right, friends. Shake it in, shake it in, shake it in. Wow, that was crazy high. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? He says, ooh, ooh, ah, ah. He loves bananas. He has a really long tail. And he likes to hang from the trees. Hmm. What is that? It's a monkey. You're right. Kiss your brain. You're so smart. A monkey lives at the zoo. Friends, monkeys can be so silly. We're going to put our monkey friend at the zoo. All right, boys and girls. Thank you so much for helping me find the animals that live at the, the zoo. I knew you guys remembered. Let's spell it one more time, ready? Z-O-O. -O. All right, friends, if you wanna do some extra practice at home, you can practice writing the word zoo or you guys can practice your animal sounds. Sounds awesome? 
That's what I think too. Friends, send me lots of videos of all the things that you are doing at home. Maybe you're practicing your zoo sounds. Maybe you're practicing writing the word zoo. I would love to see your videos. All right, guys, until next time, I'll see you later. Bye.